Hello makers and planner friends. We have another unboxing. My Sterling Ink order from her first release has arrived today. Let's take a look. Let's peek in here first. This is the little freebie sheet. I can't see my phone. Freebie sheet. And don't know where to start. Scan here to get original hand painted stickers to decorate the pages. All right, we're gonna do this one. So here is my B6 Slim. I got horizontal, full, onyx, white. Sure did. The fancy boxes. Do you guys keep the boxes? Like at the, I mean, at the end of the year, mine's so fluffy, it's not gonna fit back in here. So I haven't been keeping them, but it's sure nice. It's sure nice. All right. We have a 2025 calendar with artwork on the other side. And then We got there. We got there. Okay. Very floppy. Flippity floppy. Whew. Yes, I'm a notebook sniffer. There, I said it. It's got a smell to it for sure, but it's not horrible. It'll air out pretty easily, I think. <clears throat> I'm not gonna explain all of this because there's plenty of videos explaining it and no one's gonna do it better than Catherine herself. <clears throat> so here's the new yearly tracker though. Uh, if you don't recall, this I got this one to be my woo woo <laughs> planner where I will do all of my notations on tarot cards I pull, gratitude, affirmations, setting intentions, um, studying things like crystals and herbs and um, things like that. So I might, uh, I got horizontal because I think it will be easier. I don't need hourly for this sort of thing. And then say on Monday the 24th, I can put down what tarot card I pulled, what angel card I pulled, whatever. Um, little baby notes in here. And then maybe over here, I can do a list of gratitude and just date them individually or whatever. And any sort of reflections about the day, uh, if I want to study the card I pulled, I might take notes over here, that kind of thing. And then the other stuff that won't be a daily practice, I'll put back here. Uh, for instance, studying crystals and herbs and whatever's. Um, she is laying flat, you know me. I gotta make sure, I gotta make sure that flat means the same to me as it does to other people. She's laying flat. We're good. We're golden. It's not as important to me um, because this isn't a book that I'm going to need to just lay, sit beside me and stay open and be cooperative. Um, but yay, she lays flat. 
Uh, let's move on to the book that I am all skeptical about. Because if you saw a recent video, you know that I got a 2024 A6 compact uh, for the second part of the year thing. And it's been a battle. It has been a battle to get that stubborn little shit to lay flat. Um, so I went ahead and ordered the new one because all the videos uh, Catherine was putting out swore to me that, they, that it was going to lay flat. Some more artwork and another 2025 calendar. Here it goes. We're about to find out. <sighs> Guys, you see? So much better. So much better. I'm fine if I just got to do a little zhuzhin. That's fine. But the the ordeal that I've had to take upon myself to get that other one to lay flat. Whew, I am not here for it. I'm not here for it. So this is way better, guys. Way better. Now, will I use it for what I had intended to use it? I'm not sure yet. Because I have come up with two more things that I want to have a planner for. Uh, I've been telling myself this can be for one of them. Um, and that maybe the paper test designs yearly notebook majiggy would be better for studio. This is supposed to be studio stuff. Um, my Etsy shop, my hustle, my whatever stuff. I'm gonna ponder. I'm gonna ponder if this is best suited for that, if the paper test designs is best suited for that. Um, if this is not best suited, this might become for learning Japanese. Um, yes, I can use a basic ass notebook for that. And I actually have started one for certain parts of it, but I'm hoping that if it's dated, I will hold myself more accountable wanting to fill this in. I also have a desire to create, to use a weeks or a something um, to track the next year with my dog. I know. A lot of y'all keep planners and journals and stuff for your children. This is my child, all right? This is my child. And he's 10 and a half. And he's, he's had cancer twice. Uh, his age is, is showing a lot. And I've only suddenly gotten the notion that I should keep... <clears throat> more detailed notes on mostly good things, but the occasional, what the fuck, Dutch? What is that lump? God. So I don't know where I want to do that. I thought about getting another week's. Why they keep raising the prices on the Hobonichi site? I don't know. They were 24 when I got them and 24 like yesterday, but they're 27 now. I don't know. Anyways, this could be for that too. And then... I could make some notes about him from the day and maybe photos and I sometimes screenshot dog related nonsense off social media. I could print that out and put it here. Um, I just think it would be, see this seems excessive though. This would be excessive. That's, I don't need that many pages for, for homie. I do not. 
So I'll figure something else out for that. But this would be all right for language because notes, Japanese is hard, y'all. Japanese is hard. Um, we'll see. We'll see how that shakes out. But I'm here to tell you, she lay flat. If any of you were like, holy crap, you're right. It doesn't lay flat. That was the last year issue. Not of this, well, excuse me. That was a 2024 issue, not a 2025 issues. She's laying flat. She's being lovely. She's cooperating. She's getting in line. Yep, she's falling, in, falling into place. So that's all I got, guys. That was my first order uh, from the Sterling Ink launch. I will be placing another order on the 15th. My partner thinks that he wants a dated A5. So I will be ordering one of those and we'll see what else comes home with me. You just, no one knows. And we'll see if I order more, more Hobonichis because guys, I have impulse control issues. There, I said it. I have no restraint whatsoever and I get a notion that I want to have or do or be and try to stop me. Just try. Okay, that's all. Oh, that be six limb though. She good. She real good. Okay, I'm gonna go. Have a lovely day. It's Monday here in my world. Um, gosh, it's gonna. It's just gonna. We're gonna have an awesome week. Is what we're gonna do. There. Let's just have an awesome week and go make memories worth keeping. <laughs>